Welcome back to the channel guys, uh, just another quick video for you today. So um, did a video yesterday about math, uh, math wallet, okay, and as you can see uh, we did get the breakout and if you did get in on that then you would have made a nice 20, maybe 25%, 25% on that, okay. So I didn't actually get in on this trade, my work, because it's a new it's a new asset to me but I did point out that it did look like it was going to break out so I posted that for you guys and let you know what I was thinking about this project um, if you haven't seen the video you can go back to my previous video um, I think it was the one before the one before this one and uh, you can have a look at math wallet and what I found on that they've got a partnership with band protocol they've got great staking rewards and so on all right and yeah that's definitely uh got a break out there where will we see it go you can see another line of resistance there let's uh get the horizontals out and just mark that in as you can see it's broken through both lines of resistance one two and um yeah if i was trading this i'll be looking at it coming getting a bounce off there maybe potentially or you know if it does break that level it could come back down there you know um there's not really much chart history for me to go by in regards to the structure of this chart and the way it moves normally so um just go with the horizontals there's no patterns to trade at the moment or anything like that but it does um look like uh, it's one that's interesting me right now i'd be interested to see what it does from here whether it really gets some momentum some volume to the upside uh, yeah, that's one you'll you'd have to make up your mind on, guys. Or if you want to take a position in this or not, like I say, it'd be better to get a pullback, you know. And um, yeah, that's math wallet. So congratulations if you did get in on that. Now I don't get in every trade, guys. You know, sometimes it's good to just analyze and uh, watch the charts, find out what's going on, find out how they're moving. It gives you more confidence in making trades uh, later on, so you don't have to be in every trade all of the time. All right, at the end of the day, um, I did miss out on this one, 25% um, roughly, but uh, you know, it's not something that bothers me really, you know. This is on my radar now, so we'll be, um, we might be taking more of a look at Math Wallet going forward. Okay, so yeah. Uh, we went over some of the uh, fundamentals on it yesterday, so, and you can uh, go back and see the video, uh, the previous video on Math Wallet. All right, guys. Looking at spark point, right? So nothing major happening. We're going into a new week. Um, we're going into a new week uh, uh, tomorrow, <laughs> just a couple of hours. All right, but there was actually an announcement, an announcement from spark point. Okay, in regards to an exchange listing. All right, so they're now listed at Stex Exchange. All right, Stex Exchange. If I didn't say that properly, Stex. That's S T E X. I'll post. I'll put a little um, screenshot on the screen from the announcement from the Telegram group. All right. But yeah, uh, Stex is a centralized exchange, and uh, yeah, there's the name of the exchange that we're waiting for for the listing. All right. Um, hopefully, we'll see uh, some big moves from Sparkpoint going forward. Um, as you can see from the chart. It is in decision mode whether it wants to go up or down. We'll have to wait and see how next week plays out. All right, but yeah, like I've said in previous videos, I'm long term holding Spark Point now. So, you know, I've got high hopes for this project uh, in, um, in the long term. Uh, the future look, is looking bright for this monthly roadmaps and uh, new exchange listings, um, you know, new game developments, app development. Um, yeah, Spark Point. Uh, uh, one to watch guys if you're not in on it do your research have a look at this project make sure you don't miss out on this one because the long-term potential is sky's the limit guys you can see it's still very cheap you know one tenth of a, of a penny all right uh, just over okay 
Um, so yeah, definitely one to watch, Spark Point. All right, most of you watching this channel probably already got in on some of the massive games that we've seen already in Spark Point. All right, and uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to see what else uh, this project can achieve um, in regards to you know fundamentals and development and uh, also uh, price action. All right, guys. So if we look at Stex.com, first time I've been on this platform, guys. Like I said, I have heard of it before. Don't know much about it though. Um, but yeah, I mean, Sparkpoint is a Filipino uh, company, all right. So I don't know whether this is uh, popular in the Philippines or anything like that. But uh, yeah, it's definitely. Where do we go? Let's go into trade. Let's check out this exchange quickly, guys, and see what um, what's going on with this exchange. Okay, don't really like the layout. Wonder whether you can change it or whatever. But yeah, there's another one like System Coin, Stacks. Don't really know those exchanges uh, very much, but they look like they, they look designed quite well. Not my cup of tea, you know. Obviously, we used to, you know, um, different uh, type type of setup. But um, got simplified mode over here. Okay, so this one might take a little bit, a little while trying to figure out um, how it all works and stuff like that. But um, it's a welcome addition for Sparkpoint, in um, my opinion. The end of the another exchange just means, you know, uh, more liquidity, more uh, buyers coming into the market. I do wonder what whether this has been updated on coin market cap yet while I'm talking in coin market cap spark point okay okay so it's not been updated on here yet but maybe it will be uh, during the week maybe you just see that system coin has been added now that listing and if you did want to pick up some 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 spark point i'll be directing you to bitmark you know and um you know i wouldn't even necessarily choose uniswap either because uh i, I just i just prefer that if i can pick it up on, a, on an exchange where you know rather than a swap uh, rather than just doing a swap with like a high gas fee or something i'd rather just buy it on an exchange for a low fee um a low fee on on a, on a trading exchange and just uh, pick up my my tokens like that all right guys so yeah spa point is one to watch for me um and I, and I think that you know there's huge potential for it guys uh bitmart i, I like bitmart you know i've been scaling i've been um uh, scaling the charts in bitmart to find out what you know what the, what gems they've got on here because you know i've been quite happy with some of the performance the performance of some of these uh cryptocurrencies we've even got the likes of sweet i've got a huge bag of this uh you know it's a bit of a Bit of a risky one this you can see this one's been going up since december this one's just crazy guys i'm not even going to get into that at the moment going back to spark point i'm curious to see how the rest of the week is going to play out with this obviously with the new exchange uh, we've got the roadmap as well for august 2020 which we've looked at before we've got spark play um spark DeFi, okay and um the uniswap integration all right um which we've already seen anyway but yeah it's, it's uh they're doing a monthly roadmap so we'll see what they've got in store for september um there's only you know about two weeks left of this month or so you know not long before we uh, get to potentially see the next roadmap so that's something definitely to huddle for quite pleased with this one um so yeah it's just a quick update guys uh Stex exchange spark point is now listed on there going live and uh that's it for now guys if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe to the channel like uh, leave a comment down below and i'll see you again in the next one